All right, Blue Jay fans, I have officially had enough. And if you agree with me, it'd be great if you hit that subscribe button and join the family we got going on here. And if you don't agree with me, eh, you can hit the subscribe button as well and join La Familia of Teo Sports Talk because the Toronto Blue Jays, ha, <laughs> ha, Oh, they're, I don't even know the right words to use. They're they're painful. They are embarrassing. They give you the fake comeback, the little bit of hope, and yank it away. But it all leads back to one thing. George Springer continuing to lead off for this team is a debacle. Now, I know we're going to hear, well, George doesn't like hitting non-leadoff. You know what everybody else doesn't like? Your leadoff guy sucking the big wad. George's got an OPS in the 500s. As of right now, Blue Jay fans, be honest with me. Would you be more comfortable with George at the plate or IKF? Because I know who I'd choose right now. Which is nuts to even think about. Going into, day, going into play today, George Springer had an OBP of like 270-something and an OPS of 570. It is awful. I don't care what he's making. I don't care. Oh, I hurt his feelings. If your feelings are hurt, play better. And if you can't and you're just old, well, then don't don't throw a hissy fit and go to bat eighth in the lineup because you've been no good. It's been embarrassing. And watching Tyler Alexander today. Yes, Tyler Alexander. If you watched my last video, I didn't even really preview the series because we didn't even know who the hell was pitching. Tyler Alexander had a perfect game. Not a no-hitter. A perfect game. Through seven. Through seven innings. At home at Rogers Center. It's embarrassing. And then the Jays surely mount this weird fake comeback. As Jansen, it's a blooper. David Schneider, it's a two-run shot, making it 4-2. Then they get a few more hits. Score another run, make it 4-3. But who comes up to the plate? <laughs> George Springer. Ground ball, double play, inning over. And then the meteor order in the bottom half of the ninth inning, it does nothing. It is absolutely nothing. It's embarrassing. And if you guys have not seen the news, by the way, go check out the uh, the uh, Blue Jay Center Instagram page because that's where me and the boys are always at. I'll be hosting game lives after the games and all that stuff on there. Uh, not every game, but a few games a week, maybe once a week, twice a week, something like that. And they posted on their page today and just tonight that Ross Atkins is going to be talking to the media tomorrow at 1045 in the morning. Now, as much as Blue Jay fans would go, oh, what's he going to say? He's not going to say a damn thing, okay? He's not going to say a damn thing. He's a robot. It's not going to happen. Don't expect him to say, no, we're looking to pivot and trade all these guys. You're not going to get that. But I am intrigued to see what he does give us, if anything. So, by the way, yeah, so, so check out the ATOS or the uh, Blue Jay Center Instagram page to get all your up-to-date info on the Jays and all that stuff. But I'm so sick and tired of this team. Like I'm maybe playing. I was I was at my you know I had my baseball tonight and I forgot the Jays were playing, and then they went down three nothing, you know, and uh, and it was, it was three nothing what in the sixth inning because of course nobody they didn't score a run in the first six or first five, but they went down three nothing and everyone knew it was curtains at that point, right? And I saw the score, and I saw no hits, and I'm like, okay, enough of this. I'm turning my phone off. Like, I, I don't want to deal with this right now. I enjoyed the night with my friends and all that stuff. I, I'm, not, I'm not dealing with a, a Blue Jays absolute stinker. But then I got locked in because I'm like, wait, they're getting perfect gamed. Perfect game through seven. And we were down four nothing. And then the fake comeback comes, and of course, I'm going to be this Jays fan. I'll be like, oh, maybe? And it's like, no, you're an idiot, bud. It's not going to happen. And they lose. But I know we're going to talk about George Springer. That's the big part of conversation right now. After the game today, George Springer, who went 0 for 4 with a strikeout today, is hitting a buck 96 with a 271 on base percentage and an OPS, again, this is before the game, a 572. What in this stratosphere, what in the analytics 
tells me that should be your leadoff hitter every day. Nothing. You know what does? This. Money. And that's all it is. If it's about hurting feelings and paychecks, then what are we doing here? That's all I got to say. I'm done. I don't want to talk about this anymore. Uh, game two tomorrow, I guess. The Rays, 307 first pitch. Zach Eflin, Kevin Gosman. Like I said, I might be at that game tomorrow. So I, maybe later than usual. But regardless, I'm going to be doing the video tomorrow for you guys. Game two, Jays and Rays. I don't know. We'll see how it happens. Uh, as for the Toronto Maple Leafs and Raptors, whatever happens with the offseason, you know I'll have your uh, have your backs covered. I don't know. that. Nah, it's not... <laughs> Whatever. I'm exhausted. Uh, Blue Jays edition. I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. All right. So, if you, you know what, guys? That's going to do it for this one. If you enjoyed the video and not the game, because he obviously didn't. Hit the like button. to appreciate it. Hit the subscribe button. If you guys not done so already, comment down below your thoughts on the video. Thoughts on whatever that was tonight. Uh, let me know in the comments. Twitter, Discord, Instagram, and of course, TikTok is down below. So, follow up there if you haven't done so already. And I will talk to you guys. Um, yeah, I'm not going to say Raptors or Leafs because they're done. Jays edition tomorrow. 307 first pitcher Rogers Center. Kevin Gosman, Zach Eflin. Game two of the three-game series against the Tampa Bay Rays. Thank you guys so much for listening and watching. I hope you enjoyed the video and my misery. We'll talk to you guys then.